Hi everyone and welcome to another edition of Wreckfish West's How To. Today we're going to go out and chase some herring and I thought I'd take you through the rig we're going to use before we head out. To tie this rig, you'll need a plastic burley cage. They come in two pieces, they clip together. Fantastic little things, you can put your burley in these and when you cast your line out, the burley disperses right where you're baiting, so these are fantastic. Now all you need to do, grab the small part of the burley cage, thread it on point first onto your main line then you need to grab the other half of the burly cage, thread your line through the bottom, which can be a bit tricky at times, like so. Small swivel on the end of that, stop it running down to the hook. Now, I like to tie a uni knot, but use whatever knot you're comfortable tying. Remember to trim your tags down. Next we'll need a length of leader. Now I'm using 12 pound here. About 30 to 40 centimetres is plenty. Small long shanked hook. We tie that to one end of the leader. Again with a uni knot. Always remember to lubricate your knots, trim your tag. The other end of the leader, we tie to the swivel, which is already on the end of our main line. Trim your tag again. Now you're ready to go. Your burly cage will run right down to your swivel. Clip the top on, once it's full of burly. And away you go. So we've tied our herring rig successfully. We've brought the boat outside of the harbour and bear in mind if you're fishing off the shore, all these rules still apply. We've anchored up and the first thing we need to do is set a burly trail. Now we've got some pre-made burly here today. All I'm doing is giving it a couple of shakes every minute or two. And so far so good. We've got a nice oil slick out the back of the boat and the fish are coming right up to the back of the boat. We've got some herring, we've got some garfish, and also some trumpeter. Now, I've chosen to use the plastic burly cage, and I've got a small strip of squid for bait. All we need to do is thread it on the hook a couple of times. You can fill your burly cage with burly if you want. I'm not gonna bother on this occasion because I've got enough burly in the water. Quick flick out into the burly trail and the waiting game begins. Slow retrieve and we're on. Nice little herring. Herring are fantastic fish for the kids. They're readily available. They fight really well. Easy as you like. 